everyone, it is Nona Grace. And my grandson asked me, is that a wig? Oh, wait a minute, I'm from Western New York. And I said, <laughs> no, this is my own hair. But, hold on a second, I will put on the wig because I feel more comfortable with it on. Hi, everyone, it's Nona Grace again. And I am from Western New York. Today, well, actually, yesterday, I forgot to, to, to show you, I got a card in the mail from Ian, Ian Ye Gath, I think is how he's, Ian Y. Gath. Ye Gath, I think it would be Ye Gath, I think. Anyways, he's from Canada. I had enter, it entered into one of his, his um, drawings that he had for a painting. And it was really quite interesting the way he did it because Cousin Ralph told a story. This is Cousin Ralph. Cousin Ralph told the story. And you had to name the games that he was naming and the three different companies that make games. Well, this is a sticker that he put into the card. It was a thank you card for entering his giveaway. Look at this. Isn't that something? And he also added other stickers to it because he is into a metal detecting. He has a metal detecting sticker. He tells stories. The one that I enjoyed the most was the one that he did on Robin Hood. That one I liked the best. But he tells a groaner joke every time he does um, a video also. And he also does cooking. And when he cooks, he sings a little song that goes along with the meal that he's cooking. It's, he's really a, a great guy to listen to. And he, thank, he thanked me for being part of his channel family and for taking part in his cousin Ralph's gaw. Or gaw? Yeah. Oh, gaw. <laughs> I did it again. Giveaway. Giveaway. It's a G-A-W. <laughs> <laughs> I did that earlier, too. And Jim had to correct me. It's it looks like God G A W giveaway. <laughs> so now you used to act. I'm not act. I'm not. But anyways, I thank you so much, Ian, for this. This is this was fun. It made me laugh before, and it made me laugh again. I'm also going to put a little video in. I had showed you my my romaine lettuce and growing it. I want to show you something. So we'll go to that. I thought I'd give you a little update on this romaine lettuce that I'm growing. I wanted to show you that this one, this one is a week old. And those I thought were a week old, but actually they're three weeks old. I mean, when I showed you the last time, I think they're three weeks old. But what I wanted to show you is one of them, these two were started at the same time. But only one of them is starting to get a root. Here, do you want to hold the camera? Because I've got a... It doesn't... And this one... Oh, there it is. Sometimes the root hangs down. Apparently it didn't want to hang down. This is the root. Do you see the root? Mm, it's right kind here. Of oh. Back in here where the... Go the other way up. Or the, up, up. This way. Like that? No, the other way. <laughs> like which way? Like that. Oh, uh, I don't know. I can't see in the camera that you're seeing. There we go. See there? George told me that it would root. And yes, it is rooting. But only this one. This one was put in at the same time. Whoops, I don't want to spill it. This one was put in at the same time, but there's no roots. And this one was put in a week ago. And there's no roots. And this one we just put in. So of course there's no there's no growth and oh what do I have on me? No growth and no roots either. Farmer G told me that they would root, and it's taking it a long time to root. The one was showing a little tiny little stubble, and then I thought, well maybe it'll show more. It hasn't yet, and none of the others have started to root yet. But I wanted to say thank you, Farmer G, for telling me that it would root. And I am so glad that it is rooting because I do want to put them in the dirt and see if they grow even 
better in the dirt, which I think they will because they'll get some nutrients from the ground. So that is what I'm doing with the romaine lettuce. I'm done. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this was a fast video. I am all done. And I will talk to you all again tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.